Welcome back everyone, Fat2Blocks here. I am playing a little game called PID. At least I think that's how you say it, PID. Um, and this is an indie adventure action platformer kind of game. Um, and I have the description here, I'm going to read it out for you guys. A young boy named Kurt finds himself stranded on a peculiar planet and he must find his way home. Finding help from unlikely allies and the curious tools in his backpack, Kurt must use gravity-defying beams to conquer every platform and solve every puzzle on this strange journey. So I really like um, the art and the graphics of this game, so I'm going to play it. I was also um, suggested to play a game that has an ending, and so this is a game that has an ending. And I thought that was a very good point because Minecraft doesn't really have an ending and you can play FTL for as long as you want and it probably won't end until you get all the ships. And so this is kind of, it's kind of slow, but the idea is more fast paced. Um, and uh, so I thought I was going to play, I would play this. I'm trying to appeal to different tech groups of people, people who want to watch just Minecraft and people who want to watch tons of other videos, other gameplay. Um, and so, if you guys, you know, are having, like, you don't like what I'm, if I'm playing other indie games, just don't watch it. It's fine. I will still be uploading Minecraft videos. I just would, I just really wanted to showcase this game because I haven't really played it, um, but the graphics, the, the whole storyline kind of, um, is really intriguing, I think. So let's start a new game, single player, in normal mode. And I've only played this for like 10, 15 minutes, but I really like it. And we're gonna kind of time ourselves. We're gonna play for about 15 minutes, um, and then we're gonna call it good. So let me set my timer right now on my phone for 15 minutes. All right, and here we go. So it looks like he was getting on the bus to go home. And I'm not gonna try to talk too much in this video. Um, just gonna focus on the gameplay. It's a puzzle game. So I might get frustrated and you might get frustrated and the answer might be obvious to you and it might be right in front of my face, but I probably will miss it. Um, but spare me, have some mercy. And uh, I think I've almost reached 50 subscribers, which is brilliant, just awesome. Um, and like I said in the last video, if you guys missed it, at 100 subscribers, I will be giving away a game, probably either PID or FTL um, on Steam or probably something, a game of your choice. Um, but yeah, so let your friends know, you know, comment, rate, feedback, subscribe, and uh, Let's get to 100 subscribers. I fell asleep on the bus and the driver just dropped me off here. Can you tell me when the next bus to Whistleton leaves? That doesn't seem right now, does it? But you are in luck, child. The bus heading to Whistleton should be arriving any minute now. You are welcome to wait with us. Thank you, kind old man. Let's not, let's be careful not to step on his beard. Whoop. Well, that's a lie. You're not from around here, are you? And you want to leave, right? So do I. But if you're just waiting around with them, you'll be waiting a very long time. <laughs> but that man said the bus was coming any minute. Gregory? He was just a kid when he started waiting for that bus. Not much older than you. His generation is having trouble accepting the changes that have been going on around here. Are you saying that buses don't come here anymore? 
They must have just changed their routes or something. Bye. There's something wrong with the traffic here. Nobody knows why. There are rumors that the buses leave from the big city, but there's no way to get there because the local traffic has also stopped. This is a nightmare. Surely there must have been some way to the city. I mean, I'll walk if I have to. Walk to the city? I wouldn't recommend it. But if you are going to try anyway, the only route I know is via the old castle. I haven't heard of anyone passing through here in years. It's all sealed up. I have to try. Are you coming with me? I'm not going to stay here another minute. I really can't. Good luck on your journey. I hope you find your way home. What's your name, by the way? Kurt. All right, let's go. Z to jump, arrow keys. The jump is cut, like, it's kind of like, um, the jump is a little slow, so it's kind of hard to get used to the controls. But I'm gonna try not to fail you guys here. Probably turn my steam alerts off. I'll do that next. I'll do that next. Next playthrough. <clears throat> All right. So what do we have here? S to talk to this person. I haven't seen you before. You're not one of those kids that sneaks around poking his nose where it doesn't belong, are you? No, madam. I'm not. I'm on my way to the city, and I just want to catch the bus home. What is this place? This used to be workspaces in the olden days, but things have changed a lot. I'm the only one that still comes here. I'm not surprised though, it is far from hospitable. Reaching the city is not an easy task, I'm afraid. The guards are everywhere. You must keep a low profile around them. They don't like people walking around too much. Don't get into trouble. Hi, hi, Captain. Don't get into any trouble. Reception. Door? Oh no, down here. Throughout the adventure, there are souvenirs that Kurt can collect. Search for them in places that are hard to reach. I might as well collect some memories from this place. Looks like I will be staying a while. This old bu bus ticket is out of date, but it's a nice souvenir. I'll hang on to it. I just found a secret souvenir. Ooh, look, there's spikes down there. Okay, these guys are not friendly. You can view your collected souvenirs in your backpack to access and exit the backpack. Press A. Whoa. Woo! Ooh, that was close. Robots, it looks like. Mm -hmm. 
laser. Those stars, there we go. I have no idea what these stars are for, but I think we'll find out eventually. whole like the whole ribbon thing and the whole the way this game looks I really like it it's really appealing to me all right guys let's do this I had to pause for a second because my sister came home and my dog was barking but let's do this come on Kurt we're gonna get you out of here Looks like we've got a guard here, um, protecting a door. Okay, and let's grab this chest, shall we? This glowing ball, it won't let go. The beam, a mystical energy that won't seem to let go of Kirk. The beam allows Kirk to reach places that are normally out of range. Mm hmm. So if I jump, I can toss it and it'll create a beam. Reminds me of Portal. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you guys see that up there? It looks like there's bonus. Whoa. Let's try and get the bonus. Uh, I keep clicking A. Um, controls are so hard to get used to. Okay. <laughs> Let's try that again. Complicated. Okay. Um. Perfect. We got it. Secret constellation stars are worth twice as much as normal stars. Sweet mama. Let's do this. Ooh. All right. Haha, -ha, we did it. All right, moving on. I suddenly forgot how to jump. Let's do this.
gonna to beam happy here.